you guys get a call, you get cast in Outlander, what's the first thing you do? I don't know, what was the first thing you did? I was like, uh-oh, I've got to learn how to speak Scottish. <laughs> <laughs> what did I first do? I think I might have maybe opened a bottle of wine and had a little drink, probably. A wee dram. A wee dram, yeah. Uh, I've seen the first two episodes, and I gotta say, I love Frank, and I'm, I just, ah. I just love him oh, so much. Yes. We need some, we need some Frank supporters. Let's, let's shout it out. I, I was Good job. Everyone goes on about Jack, but what about Frank? Yeah. I like Frank too. Yeah. 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 Are going to see more of him, or, or, is, or are you just kind of... more in the series than in the book, yes. Uh, we have developed him. Um, I suppose we wanted to have um, like the relationship between Claire and Frank to be a really kind of uh, an important relationship so that when she loses it or makes the choice to not to go back, it meant quite a bit, you know. So it was a lot to lose. Um, and so to do that, we go back to him more in flashback. Um, so, yeah. Um, and I think... Uh, I think it's I think it's really nicely fleshed out because I think he is an interesting person. You know. But it's interesting that people are naturally maybe sort of more drawn or interested in the uh, darker character. Like for you, that's really cl clear between the two. People seem to find that really interesting if there's a, like a dark yeah. little well, I mean, edge. Jack is just a bit flasher, isn't he? But uh, but don't, you know, don't don't just look at the sparkle, right? Uh, yeah. <laughs> well, a bit of sparkle yeah. here and there. I mean, <laughs> right? <laughs> right. <laughs> Do you guys have a message for the fans as they get ready to watch the first episode? Uh, well, tune in on uh, August the 9th, and I, um, yeah, I really hope you enjoy it. Thank you so much for the support, and um, enjoy it.